All right. Up next, we should be going back to the uh, the little island where we turned on the uh, the water. We should be heading back there now. Oops. Excellent shooting, Jack. Never thought about being a wastelander? Hmm? Can't say that I have. Wastelanders find items from the outside the city walls, eh? Any artifact or weapon worth having comes through my hands. Work for me and I'll throw some of the sweeter items your way. Kill metalheads? Get toys? Sounds good to me. Slow down, Jack and a fat man. You two had better run that by me again. Cause there's no way I'm going outside the city to face more metalheads! Sig will show you the ropes. So you want to be Wastelanders, huh, Doe boys? Well, we'll see what you're made of when we get out in the thick. Crew wants some new trophies to put butts in chairs at the hip hog, so I'm going to bag him five nasty metalheads at the pumping station. Don't wet your fur, Chili Pepper, because we're rolling with the Peacemaker. Woo! I need one of those. Where'd you get it? Don't ask. Sig needs someone to watch his back while he tracks the metalheads, eh? We'll meet at the pumping station. Listen, Cherries, don't you leave me dangling in the wind out there. Let's do it. God, I love Sig. Such a good character. Oops. Ah. Wrong button. I gotta be careful now that I have a gun. Gotta be careful. Oops. I'm sorry, I'm I'm new with this. Oh no. Oh, it's so slippery. They just fire wildly. They could be hitting civilians. Irresponsible. Who's suspicious? Couldn't be me. <laughs> Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me! Uh... I have no idea where he went, officer. It was crazy, he just exploded. It was nuts. It was nuts, officer. That guy just exploded. I grazed him. I was almost stationary. That cop should have gone around me. How dare you. Why are you harassing innocent civilians when you should be going out and catching the real bad guys? Waste of my taxpayer dollars. Perfectly fine. We're fine. Hunt a few metalheads. Follow me. Stick close and watch my six. It's gonna be fun. Here we go. Yeah, in a, in a second. Here comes 
Problem is, there's friendly fire. And when we're handed a shotgun, that makes not committing friendly fire very difficult. Get behind me while I toast that tank. Go ahead. I'm not stopping you. Show us what the peacemaker can do. Absolutely. All right, I'll jump down there and get the egg. Oh, am I not staying close enough for you, Sig? Working on it. Hmm. I seem to have fallen. I think I walked too far away. But, well, wrong button. I got the egg. That's all that matters. And then he's gonna blow that up. Get behind me while I toast that tank. This way. Tell me what to do. Maybe I will get cocky. Let's get across the bridge before they come back. Done and done. There's our first target. Keep the other creatures back while I charge up the peacemaker. That is a very toxic way to think. I mean, like, yeah, the metalheads suck, but, like... Shoot first, ask questions later is a uh, very poor way to do business. You're not staying informed. And as we know, knowing is half the battle. Could be healthier. Got the what? Who? Oh. Great, no 
Time to celebrate. Watch my six while I toast this bad boy. The trick is to not hit the pipes. You don't say. That's three? Now that's what I call blowing someone's mind. Okay, now I gotta be careful. This is usually the point where I really start mucking up this mission. Alright, there's, uh, one more after this, two more after this. Last target, okay. God, I hate this mission. Say goodnight, baby. There, it's over. First mission with Sid. Home team five, metalheads nothing. That was the last one. Tell crew we got them all cooked and canned. I'm gonna clean Peacemaker and pick up the trophies. You did good, rookie. All right, and I, again, just the environmental storytelling. I love the, sh the shrapnel from the exploded canister. That just stays there. They didn't have to do that, but they did. <laughs> and do we have? We have 27. Teach me. Yeah. Dank Eco Jack. As a reward, I grant you a dark power. Cool. Where'd my car go? They took my car. I have a new one. And now we have to head back to the uh, Hip Hog Heaven Saloon. Which, if you'll recall, uh, the Rats minigame in Jag 1 
That was to get uh, Farley the Hip Hog. So that's two Hip Hogs we see in the game. I just think it's cool that like they have weird specific animal hybrids as like an you know their animals in this world, yak cows and stuff. And again, they just keep the consistency. Shit. Ah. Not really. I mean, if you can't see me anymore, I'm okay with that. Go ahead, lose track of me. Avoid everyone else. Is there a hip hog? There is a hip hog on the saloon. Look at him. That's a friend. You boys are turning out to be quite useful, eh? I have another task for you. The sewers used to be a fabulous smuggling route for me before the Baron installed security devices. And before those late night snack runs kept you from fitting out the front door. I bet you've hatched another brilliant plan in that hungry little brain of yours. So, who or what do we have to shake down, knock out, or blow up? Well, I need someone to go down and shoot every sentry gun in the sewers. And I'll give you a sweet weapon upgrade if you succeed. Let me guess. Dank murky water? Reeks worse than your breath at an oyster fest? Fuller of metalheads than your plate at a one-pass buffet? And of course, weapons more lethal than your ever so tidy whiteies on a hot summer day. Look, Donut Hall, why don't we float around here looking hot and heavy and you go roto root the pipes? We're not doing anything until you tell us why metalheads are trading with the Baron's forces. Oh, I should have had some boat kneecaps, eh? All I know is that the Baron caught a desperate deal with the metalhead leader. Metalheads need eco, so the Baron supplies them with regular shipments. In return, the metalheads agree to attack the city just enough to satisfy the Baron's continued rule. Yeah. But how long can that deal last? Well, the Baron is running short on eco, eh? And the Metalheads are short on patience. Baron Praxis needs this wall to keep in power. Otherwise, the city would put the true ruler on the throne. Wherever that little brat is. Daxter and I will clear your sewers. And we haven't forgotten about that weapons upgrade you promised in return. Bloodsuckers. Hey, man. We just want to get paid for our job. Also, how do we feel about the pole in the middle of the wrestling ring? Please advise. Suspect's description. Just something I'd like to point out. Something I will say that's... Uh, interesting something that bothers me kind of um so there's obviously some very clever writers working on this game 
You know, I'm pretty sure back at Naughty Dog when they're making this game, some big some big names in the gaming industry would emerge from this project, this original trilogy. I think like, uh, oh oh oh, what was her name? She was sweeping for suspects. Not not Amy Pascal. She's in charge of Sony. She's in charge of the. Sony Marvel stuff, I think. Uh, this is unit alpha. There's there's a handful of people that I know got like big careers going. Like obviously, Naughty Dog in general would go on to do like Uncharted and uh, The Last of Us, which have pretty good writing. You know, those are well constructed games. Despite despite Last of Us kind of being morally tone deaf. I just want to I just want to explain how I feel about other naughty dog games before we get too far. Like The Last of Us specifically, Last of Us Part 2. The moral of the the moral is you know, oh, if I kill the bad guy, that'll make me just as bad as the bad guy. But the gameplay has you killing so many people. So, like, it's morally bankrupt. I gotta get close enough. All they gave me is a shotgun. Come on, can I look down the... Yeah. Gross. But yeah, so like, I enjoy The Last of Us games, not my favorite. And I know that can be divisive for some. Some people absolutely love those games, but you know. But yeah, so the, the writing in this game can be very good. Just getting back to my initial point. The very good writing, however, there's no like cool mission names, or like, it's, there's three acts to the game, it's a three act structure, so, you know, they're just labeled act one, act two, act three, and there's, like, for, for the sewer mission, you know, you could have, you could have called it as something as simple as cleaning up the sewer, sewer sentry shootout, like, there's some cool possibilities, but the most Good work so far. bombs in the water but we don't we don't get that we get the mission objectives destroy turrets and, turrets and sewer like that's the, the name of the mission destroy turrets and sewer you can shorthand it to like sewers one the tour the turret sewer it, it. Damn it. Alright. Lots of metalheads in the dark over there. Oh wait, I have enough for Dark Eco Jack. Which triggers is it? What do I hold down? Yeah. How do I turn back? Um. Cool. That. Um. Let's go fill up on more dark eco. Is there any left back here? Or did I pick it all up? Damn it. Okay. I wasted that.
One more turret. What was it shooting at? That's a wall. Okay. Almost had it. sewer has been cleaned out for now. I'm sure now that the turrets are gone, the metalhead problem can only get worse. Those turrets were designed to keep the metalheads out of the sewers. Oh look, a car we don't have to steal. I like how in the vehicle, Daxter is given the gun. Probably put that away. I personally would not give Daxter a gun. Damn it, damn it. Doug Dimma, damn it. Okay. I just realized. I. Okay. While this cutscene's playing. What is that horrible smell? Oh, great! We do your dirty work in the sewers and come back smelling worse than a wet hip hog in a warm barn. This could have a serious impact on the lady factor. No. I think it was my lunch, actually. We're good. Nice work in the sewers, eh? I guess you're looking for that weapon upgrade. Yes. Well, there's a blaster mod stashed in some crates at the port. Find it, and it's yours. <laughs> Thanks. Some reward. Imagine if your boss. Imagine like at the end of the pay period, and you were looking to, for like a check, like a paycheck from your boss, and the response was like, I, you know, uh, somewhere on the mall here, you know. Uh, or, you know, wherever you work, mini mall, like if you work in like a big box store, or wherever you work, there's like, eh, you know, somewhere around here, there might be, uh, like a golden ticket style, you know, Willy Wonka. Open up all of the product in the store, and somewhere around here is your paycheck. What if there's like, you know, we'll say like 50 people working at a Walmart and it's like somewhere around the store there's 50 paychecks hidden. However many you find is however many you keep. So there's like some people that go without a paycheck. Please don't make me. You can switch weapon modes at any time. You can combo your attacks by kicking, then firing your weapon. Kick the first target, then shoot while kicking to automatically hit the second target. That's a wastelander move. They won't know what 
find him. Please leave. No, I don't. Don't make me do the gun course. Yay! Um, let's go back and talk to Crew. We have a mission with Crew and a mission with Torn. Crew is just right here. Let's go talk to him. I have a proposition for you, Jack. Racing is the biggest sport in the city. Errol is the undisputed grand champion. He's crazy and dangerous on the track. <laughs> My kind of guy. Only a fool would dare race against him, eh? And that's where you two come in. A client of mine is looking for a fast driver for her racing team. Here's a security pass to get you into the stadium section. Uh, and your contract with just a few trifles for me. <laughs> I've uh, already signed your name to save time. Hmm? Cool. We the racers hereby agree to give crew all proceeds from race earnings, endorsement fees, broadcast royalties, syndication residuals, vehicle sponsorships, small appearance fees, collectible card assets, fast food tie-ins, use of likeness rights, talk show deals, clothing lines, all print rights, including book, novella, comic, pamphlet, ticket tape, neon sign, and bathroom graffiti designs. <sighs> Toy rights, shoe lines, mood rings, game rights. Game rights? Vitamin endorsements, city kickback, movie deals, and of course, all death and dismemberment accident insurance claims. <laughs> we can work out the tiny details later. If you can get from here to the race garage near the stadium in less than three minutes, my client said she would consider letting you drive for her team. Make me proud, hmm? Who would want game rights to Jack and Daxter? I had to, I had to say, let's go talk to Crew. He's right here. Cause, cause now we're doing the racing stuff. God, I hate the racing stuff in this game. I've no, I know I've complained about it and I will continue to complain about how the vehicles handle. Cause like in the, in this game, they they float. So you know, I get why the handling could be kind of weird. In Jack Three, some of the vehicles. Oh come on! In Jack Three, some of the vehicles have wheels. So why are they just as floaty? Alright, so realistically, I have to get through four sections of the city in three minutes. We've got to get through... I don't think I'm going to get get it in this first try, but we got to get through the waterfront to the industrial district to the slums, and then finally to this, uh, stadium district. Oh, come on. Oh, we got it. Okay. Said someone was looking for a race driver. 
I'm busy right now. You must be Crew's new errand boy. Look, I don't mean to be rude. You did get here fast. But I'm not interested in any new drivers right now. And I've got work to do. Is there anything we can do? No! I'm, uh, working on a secret, uh, uh, vehicle project. Okay, sorry. Listen, if you think you've got the guts to race in this town, try taking my prototype jet board out on the stadium. Jet board! Beat the stadium challenge, and maybe I'll consider you for my team. Such lewd adult themes in my game. How dare they? <sighs> what? Where am I? Okay. Well, I mean, on the bright side, the jet board's pretty good. On the downside, I hate the I, I hate the jet board course. Just what I wanted to do. You can spin in the air, land a perfect three sixty for a speed boost. Come on. Okay. Try to put a number of moves together. Oh, I died. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Uh, on the, on the thing, on the thing. Working on it. Good enough. Yeah, five fifty thousand for a bronze. Nah. No, I'm gonna have to say no to that.
That is a no from me, dog. All right. There's the way out. Nope, not what I wanted to do. On the bright side, though, we have a fast way to get around the city that does not involve stealing a car. No! Let us keep it. I want to keep it. I want to keep it! Oh, I'm pressing the button. It's not doing anything. I thought we kept it. Why would you take that from me? This is Unit Alpha. We're en route. All right. Time for the first race. Kill me. We beat the stadium. Challenge. Great. People do get lucky. Listen, don't you have someone to collect money from or beat up or something? You don't like us, do you? You work for that slime ball crew. What's not to like? Looks like you've won a few races. Isn't it true the city champion gets to tour the palace? Yeah. Why? Could you get me into the palace? A friendly visit, I gather. Yeah. I'm a real fan of the Baron. Okay. I'll help you out if you stop bothering me. I saw an old maintenance elevator at the base of one of the palace support towers. That old lift might take you up to the palace if you can find a way to turn on the elevator's power. All right. God, I am just hitting everything. I hate how the music cuts out. It feels there we go. Let me let me I did not want to do that. I wanted to use my jet board, wherever the board is. Okay, I think Torn is closer now, so we can go talk to him next. Pardon me. Coming through. I swear, officer. I don't know what happened. It's crazy. Like, I was I was just uh, minding my own business. Walking through the neighborhood. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Oh, the humanity. It's such a, it's such a terrible shame what happened to all those people. Dead. Hey, Torn, I'm sorry if cops show up at your door. I didn't do it, whatever it was. Gay icon Torn. That's not our problem. It is our problem when the foreman's one of the underground best informants. His name is Vin and he's just valuable enough to save. Find the warp gate at the power station and use it to travel to the strip mine so you can rescue Vin's pathetic hide. Hey, Tattooed Wonder, how come we get all the crappy missions? Because I don't like you. Fair enough. Whatever deal the Baron made with the Metalheads, the city's eco is almost gone. And his time is running out. If we don't get the kid back on the throne soon, time is running out. There may not be a city left to defend. His time is running out. 
I think, uh, I think Torn's voice actor might be Canadian. They did a uh, what if they did a Jack and Daxter reboot? Like, uh, cause there's there's rumors that like Naughty Dog might return to the franchise after the last couple entries were uh, not. Well, I like Daxter. I like the spinoff game that's just Daxter. But uh, after the uh, less than stellar Jack and Daxter for the Lost Frontier, I I heard that. They might be returning, or like there was con. I know there was definitely concept art for what could have been a Jack and Daxter for like a reboot or something. But what if they rebooted it with uh, the voice actors from regular show? What if it's Mordecai and Rigby as Jack and Daxter? I, I was just thinking about this because like I feel like the voice actor for Daxter, who was also uh, Doc Ock in. Uh, Spider-Man, Insomniac Spider-Man. I think he could do. I think he would do pretty okay as Daxter. I mean, let's be fair. Daxter and Rigby are the same character. Sorry to say something so bold. Yet so controversial. Okay. If I remember right, this is the only okay mission in the strip mine. There's not a lot of great missions in the strip mines. Again, where's the music? Just, I just want to shoot the flying one. God. Awful. I hate the controls. Oh, this guy's stuck. I got him. on the bright side lots of metalhead skull gems we need those for the dark power ups so that I'm okay with Again, I wish I had the board. Did I hear Skull Gem land? Huh. I thought for a second I missed one.
Please, can I find more health than that? No. Sick. Absolutely sick nasty. Just shoot somebody, I beg of you. Like, the fact that there's no lock-on in this game is ludicrous to me. Cool. Cool. All right. Note the time. Note the time when I started getting heated at Jack and Daxter. Oh, I can't wait till the rate of fire upgrade for the scatter gun. Sick. Ah! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! I I punched him. What? <laughs> Moving right along, we're moving down on the highway. If you're going my way, just keep swimming. Oh, I made it further. That's the key. I just need to brute force my way through this. Am I good? And I didn't miss a single skull gem. Hey look, egg. It's been a while since we've collected an egg.